Loads of tech balls and we're checking out the new Skull Candy Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles edition. Now these will be the push active which we reviewed several different times before the Skull IQ and the Borton X if I recall correctly. And this is the packs in here and it's nice packs in here and it's kind of lifted off there as well. And that's what the box looks like there. Give you a closer look. And that's it. So let's open them up and check them out. Let's see what these look like in the flesh. Now this is one of several collaborations that School Candy have done recently, which we've done them all. And this is the new one. So if you're a, a kid, remember these, like I do, you'd be interested in them. So you've got this guide here inside which has all the controls there. This booklet is different than before, um, which we'll be going through in the video review. You get a sticker. If you remember that, Doritos, we are doing the Doritos editions for School of Candy. You get this user guide here. You also get Turtles to pick. Let's have a look. So you get different colors. Just pop them all in there for now, so you can see. Different colour tips, there's loads in there. And of course, your cable here, which has the branding on it there. And that's that there. So let's get to what people want to see, and it's the actual product itself. So we'll get this out. And that's it there. Really nice looking case, nice and grippy, it's not slippy. And you've got your LEDs up front there, the shell on the sides and back there. Got your charging part in there. And that's pretty much it. And let's open them up. And there we go, you can see you've got the branding here. And that's what the earbuds look like inside. That's the case in there, in all its glory. And this is what we're looking at here. So it's a familiar sh shape and design, as we mentioned, we've done several before, but this is just a new collaboration they've done. And that's pretty much it there. So we'll take off them little lads there, put them on the box. And that's it and what they look like. So you've got about 44 hours of battery life in these IP55 cement mortar resistant hands-free voice control built in Alexa. And you've got personal sound by Mimi and of course you've got toilet built in as well. And you know how all those work. You've Bluetooth 5.2 as well and they weigh 95 grams. So I'm going to just give them a quick test, get the app downloaded and show you what it all looks like in case you've not seen before. But leave a link below to and see the previous reviews. And that's just what it's going to look like there from now. So we get them set up and test them out and see how they sound. Because we started this push active back in 21, I think. Around 2021. We're now 2024. And that's it now. And that's the look of them there. Nice green tube there that rests around your ear. And you've got your area here where you'll touch the command. But you can also speak to these as well, which is one feature I loved about them. And you can basically call out your higher, your volume, lower your volume, skipping, reverse tracks, all that kind of stuff, as well as your voice assistant, which is pretty cool and has been with this Push Active um, series since they came out back in 21. So stay tuned for more after break when we get them set up and we'll test them out. Hello, and I'm and we're back with the Teenage Mutant Turtle Edition Skull Candy XTMT Push Active Earbuds. So, we're not going to spend too much time on them, they're just basically identical to what we've done before with the likes of the Borton X and the Push Active Skull IQ. And you'll be familiar with the features, if not, we'll quickly go through them and show you. But the best feature is the speaking to it, you can basically use your earphones as an assistant and ask it to do basically everything which is really cool so we're going to show you that now in a minute 
but this is these here if you've not seen them before everything is all the same with just this flashy color on top which is really nice now like they've done plenty of other collaborations there we've got the buttons there and the dime too we've other ones there as well lying around we've earbuds and tech all over the house and just to show you what else they do and we've street fire stuff as well which is super cool um, so this is the collaboration with this brand here and basically what they're going to look like and that's really it, it's really cool and you get a lot of merchandise in the box as well with little bits and pieces and a nice case, a really nice case as well and you can see through the top of it there which is really nice so overall um, with this we're going to be taking a look at the app and all in a sec but they sound great uh, anyway that's all you need to know really good you got about 44 hours of battery life with rapid charge, IP55 sweat and water resistance. You have a hands free, as I said, you've got Alexa built in too. And you've got the advanced features with the School IQ app, which I think is really, really good. One of the best apps out there, um, which we said before. And nothing has changed there. I think there's a couple of new features in it um, from the previous version. But in the blog post, and that will link it below, you can see there is some differences in the app now. So it means they're working on it, which is good. It's not like some other manufacturers make apps and just leave it, and that's the end of it then, you know. So go to show they're actively working on their features and products. You've got personal sound by Mimi, and of course you can find your earbuds with the toilet again. So again, we've done all this before, but um, that's really it. So we're going to show you the app, which is this here. So let me see if we can get a bit closer. Right, so you got your voice control, and you can use your language and your voice assistance. So you've got Alexa, iHeart, and TuneIn built in there now. You've got your button settings. So you've got a single press, double press, triple press, and one second hold. And you can see I have some of them set up here. So this applies to left and right, and then you've got your double press here. And then you've got your triple press. So I have all these done. You have a triple press with the volume down. On the left and on the right, sorry, and on the other side, I've got the volume up just to give you an idea of what I've kind of set up. But you don't need that. You can just speak to it. The job is done, which is what I like. You've got your equaliser in here, presets, music, podcasts, and movie. Podcasts are actually going, and so is movie. And you can, of course, customise as well if you want to do so, which is good. You've got your toy. We know this before. You can share your audio as well if you wish to do so. You've got your personal sound, so you've got your intensity level, enabled personal sound, all that kind of stuff in there. You can edit your profile as well. And you've got your Spotify tap if you listen to Spotify, which I don't. And your voice assistance, voice control. Um, we'll be looking at that now. And here's what I was going to say to you here. We're going to show you that working now. And that will do your basically everything, which is really cool. And even ask to take a photograph so i want to show you that too so that's basically that and yeah we've got your stay aware too um enable stay aware disable it and you can turn this on or off pull it on your buttons as well if you want to do so so basically you've got a full suite of controls there to let you take control they're not fixed controls like some airbus can come which i kind of find annoying if they're not configured properly but these are fully configurable they come out of the box pretty much all set up, but there's one or two things you need to change between left and right. But overall, it's really, really good. So you've got that there, and you've got your other button up here. Disconnect, language version, all this kind of stuff in here, which you'll probably not even look at. So, for example, if I go to this, I'll say, Hey, school candy, take photo. And sometimes this is a bit hard to do. Hey, school candy, take photo. Hey school candy, take photo. So you can see how that works there. And I've also got one button assigned here, I think it's this one here, to do the same. So you've got that there, and that's what we have there for taking a photograph, which is what you like. You can see them all there. So you can go on to the music then. Hey school candy, pause. Hey school candy, play. You can see the likes of that. Hey school candy, skip. Next, hey school candy, next, hey school candy, reverse. And you can see how that works there. And um, for example, I have play and pause on this one here, on the buttons like that. And the double press is skip. 
on say triple press is volume up so again i have the opposite one on this side here so that's basically how they're going to work and like i said my favorite feature is just calling out what you can do through the earbuds which is excellent you don't have to touch any buttons at all you take a photos control your music answer your calls all that kind of stuff there so overall that's basically it for the skull candy x and i'm just going to stop that there and um that's it there these buttons can be a bit fidgety to get at depending on the size of your fingers but they do work and they work fine they do everything that you set them up to do no issues there and that's really it overall the sound is pretty good as you expect from school candy no distortion no lag latency no lag latency overall a really decent sound with that app then you've got all those customization in there the customization levels which is excellent it's one of the best apps there and that's it for now so thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one stay tuned for more from school candy by the way and uh, we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.